Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, machines and machine freaks. I'm here with Kyle S and Ian. Jake is over here. He's he's not doing anything important right now. He's, he can stay over there. We're shooting some skeet. Oh, this stuff's not... Oh, I think. You ripped it again. Trap? Trap. What's the difference? Skeet goes back and forth when it goes. Okay. Trap goes away from you. Well, my, my strategy was to go back and forth. So is it now... I'll give you a <laughs> so we got two throwers here. I'm I'm gonna be the thrower on this one. You guys want me to throw two at, no. at one time? Ian told me he had 110 skeet. Yeah, or four boxes. Or clay pigeons. Or trap, or whatever you yeah. want to call them. He had 110. So, and you guys said that you had 200 bullets. We do. So, we the two of us. so you do the math on that. Yeah. You can miss two times per pigeon. Okay. He's locked and loaded in his pockets there. Nobody shoot Ian's pocket. It won't end well for Ian. Yeah, for this guy. So it's Monday Memorial Day weekend. And things are gonna get good. Okay, this will be our first victim. Who wants to go first? So the math says that we can miss three times per pigeon, so everybody go is just gonna shoot. Is that okay. the plan? You can go first. Oh, Kyle's gonna shoot the first one. I'm gonna miss it. Okay, right. so if he misses, if he misses you gotta get it. Yeah, right? I'll get it. Ian, you gonna get this? I'm watching. He's watching. He's not even plugging your ears? Oh, great. <laughs> I don't have earplugs. <laughs> Send it. Got it, nice First Ian, your pants are awful dirty. You don't care about nothing. Two for two! Go ahead, Bull. Three for three! Kyle, if you miss this, you're gonna have to buy us all milkshakes. Milkshakes? Cool. Yeah, feels Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna need another shot. You're gonna have to get right down by the pond. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna <laughs> sling it right next. Ian's buying milkshakes. Now your pipe is leaking. I didn't hear that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nice shot, you shot right at it. I didn't hit it. All right, go ahead. Pull. Oh. Man, you guys are really going downhill quick. Oh, do you oh, oh. I could have tested if I could have broke the window or not, though. First try. People shot. Ian, <laughs> you're standing in a freaking line. Oh, all three men. What's going on? Nice. Someone just likes to shoot the shoot. I was shooting the, the aftermath. We need gun lube stat. My gun's getting uh, needs a little lubrication. Here it goes. <laughs> nice hey. shot, Dan. That was good. Danny's chasing the cows, I guess. Danny, why are you chasing the cows? He left the, he left the gate open. The gate. I wasn't. Oh. You were the last yeah, yeah, one to yeah, the I, gate. I was about, I was about to say. <laughs> he tries to say he didn't do it. Yeah, there's a bunch of cows out right now. There goes Danny. The cows are over here. You guys saw where Danny came up from, I believe. Danny, they're going to attack you, buddy. Thanks to Dan the man, the cows are safe and sound. The cows are heading home. And so are we. We're in the back of the Sonoma. Kyle and Ian. Where? Where is the sunset? Oh uh, yeah, it's got some pretty... You can't really see it on the camera though. Kyle and Ian are back there. Jake's driving the Braptastic Sonoma. Y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs> you got it, buddy! The Memorial Monday is over. Dude, we need to haul Crusher on with this thing just so we have orange towing orange. He's got the same kind of dilemma going on right here. He's got a little... His is on the rim though. God, I don't think the Machines and Machine Freaks have seen your rig. Do you want to do a little tour? What, the Kubota Yeah, the Kubota Kind of like a Yamaha. It's a gas driver diesel. <laughs> no power steering. It's got really sharp front tires. Oh yeah, brand new too. You rip up the road. Rip it right up. How tread. How often do you go through the McDonald's uh, drive through with this sucker? Actually, today we did. <laughs> we did. <laughs> did you? Yeah, no. -uh. Come on. That's now funny. You start, she blows straight soot trunks. <laughs> Not even kidding. He starts hard in the cold. Oh, very hard. He needs low potions on your nose. You don't care about nothing. He's even got this rolly thing. <laughs> the suicide over. knob. This is a high performance vehicle. Seems like everybody's been getting new toys lately, which I really, really like. Kyle's got the Kubota. Danny's got the Kodiak. I got Crush and the G. Well, that doesn't really matter. Let's not talk about that current lemon just yet. Let's talk about something good. I'm going to give away this GoPro Hero 5 Black. I'm going to run a one week long contest 
one random winner is going to win this along with along with all the hardware, mounts, things that I frankly don't even have. I know a few of you may find a use for this thing, whether you ride, whether you bike, whether you hike, whether you do anything that's interesting. This thing can definitely record it. Yes, you heard me right. This is only a one week long contest. It doesn't give you very much time to enter. So the people that are interested in winning this thing have a really, really good chance of winning it. How the GoPro giveaway works is you go to machinemerch.com for every order you make, you earn yourself an entry. So if you buy a hat, you get an entry. If you buy one decal, you earn an entry. If you buy a t-shirt, a sweatshirt, any kind of hat, Anything at machinemerch.com, you get an entry. Each entry is earned by each order number. So if you buy two decals at once, that's one entry. There also is a free entry option. You go to machinemerch.com, read the rules and guidelines. You can see how you can enter for free. Like I said, the contest only goes for one week, so get in while you can. I wish all you machines and machine freaks luck. And yes, just like that, we are in Buffalo. We are at Owl Orthodontics to get my teeth looked at. This one here is kind of warm. So we're gonna sand down my teeth with yes. the proper terminology. Some people call it like cosmetic uh, shaving. We use this tool right here. Yeah, he can show you. Put your heart. So it's just like a, like a, a Dremel. It's like a Dremel. Yeah. So they use that tool, and now my teeth look like this. It's shocking that one year and one day ago I was saying this. Today I'm getting braces. I never thought I'd be getting braces. So you guys can definitely see the difference between my teeth, right? I wear Invisalign. There are these clear trays that you put on your teeth and you change them from anywhere from like a week to two weeks and they straighten your teeth. This is what it looks like on a computer screen. So this is a scan of my teeth from day one, right? Yep. We're on, 30, we're on 34 right now. 34 is where you're at there. Now these little pink things are the attachments. Well, those are the attachments. Yeah. They help rotate your teeth. And they're actually tooth colored and reality. Yeah, they're not pink. <laughs> the purpose behind my latest visit was a refinement. Now TJ gave a really, really good analogy. I'm not familiar with golf, but you know how they drive the ball the first whack? You get a lot of progression in one hit. And then the refinements, the little wax to get it in the hole, it takes a while. So basically they're trying to hook me up with a really, really good smile. So we're refining it. We're sanding things down. They reskin my teeth and everything. So now they're ordering new sets. If you're interested in Invisalign and you're in the Buffalo area, all orthodontics information will be in the description. And then from there I got some supplies for the crush carrier. Why isn't this thing working? There it is. Love that thing. And as you can see, we got all that paneling unloaded. So we shot some skeet, we fixed some teeth. Don't forget that GoPro giveaway is only one week long, so get your orders in if you want to win a GoPro. Until next time, 3D Machines out. Have a great day. Yay!